In Revit 2018.2, the Fill Patterns dialog is now fully resizable and it remembers its size. You can now find the Pattern Search tool at the top. If you are looking for concrete, you can filter out just concrete patterns. This makes it easier to set and find the pattern you want. There is a multi-selection functionality for the pattern list. For example, you can multi-select a few patterns and delete them at once. Moreover, customer fill patterns can be easily rescaled without the PAT file. All these enhancements increase your productivity when working with fill patterns. In Revit 2018.2, the right-click menu of the project browser has four new options. Expand All, Collapse All, Expand Selected and Collapse Selected. This enhancement reduces the number of clicks needed to navigate views, sheets and other items in the project browser so that the Revit users can get their work done faster. In Revit 2018.2, once you load a family into the Revit session, the next time you load a family during that session, it remembers the location of the family you loaded last. You don't have to start from the default location and re-navigate to where the families are located. This improves your efficiency when working with Revit families and you no longer need to re-browse to the same network location over and over again in the same Revit session. When building Revit families, you may need to create complex formulas to write family parameters and types. Formulas can get lengthy in the Type Properties dialog and it is useful to adjust the size of the dialog's column widths so that the entire formulaic value can be seen. This small enhancement allows adjustments to the column widths in the Type Properties dialog to be retained in the Revit session while using the Family Editor. This improves efficiency when using Type Properties dialog because you no longer have to adjust the column widths every time it is reopened in a Revit session. Previously in Revit, the blue double triangle controls of a 3D section box needed a very accurate selection to avoid picking up some objects from the model behind them. Now in Revit 2018.2, the section box shape controls have been improved so we can more reliably adjust a section box. All of these user interface enhancements were requested by users like yourself who wanted to make designing in BIM easier and help improve their productivity and efficiency.